I'm Brian Anderson. Uh, I am the MD of, like I say, Pendle Doors Limited. We are a family-run, family-owned business uh, who specialise in timber fire-rated fire doors. Uh, so we supply into mainly main contractors and subcontractors uh, into basically any building that needs a fire door near enough. I'd actually done a couple of courses through Lancaster Uni previously, yeah. um, so going back a good number of years. Uh, so it was a case of, obviously I had an email come through about how to grow and, and what the course was about. And knowing what Lancaster had delivered in the past and how useful I found it, it was sort of a, a no-brainer for me to, to join on, in fairness. All the other courses I've been on really helpful. Uh, you get from it what you put in uh, and you can take as little or as much as you want. Uh, the one thing I've found from doing previous courses and obviously joining on this, all different topics are either relevant or not relevant at that point of time that you, you're joining the course and you're looking into different aspects. Uh, so for me it was just going back into and going over bits that I may have already done but taking different aspects again to where we are as a company now um, just the overall ability to have tutors there mentors there peers there that you can actually use and pull information from is, is fantastic and invaluable to me it was hands down without a doubt the mentor that was provided uh, so at the start of the course we we got paired with a mentor um, which was then included within the course uh, they came out and offered I think two hours or maybe a little bit more two days of their time uh, in the business one-to-one -one. Um, and my mentor was fantastic and subsequent to the course we I still use him now and he's still part and he's he's now rather than just a personal mentor a business mentor um, so that was you know been running for a good number of years now and he's still involved with the business and helping everyone uh, throughout the business so that that for me was massive to have that person there that's got a vast wealth of experience that we can draw upon and basically ask questions as and when we need the challenge at the time was how to grow um, how to get the growth within the business we know we wanted to grow we know we wanted to expand um, at the time we're turning over three million and um, probably 35 staff at that point 30 35 and it was having an understanding and a basis of what we needed to put in place at that time to help the growth, help the strategic growth, um, and what needed to be put into place to enable that to happen. Um, so he, again as part of that and understanding our my goal, the company goals, uh, helped us develop what, what he called a vision orbit, uh, which basically sets out the next four years plan, all the hypothetical plan and, and a want and wish, uh, but really help then drive what the company was looking to do, all in agreement with other directors and, and other uh, basically managers within the business. This was all agreed upon. Everyone bought into it, so then when we're pushing it out to the wider workforce, it was a team goal that we wanted to hit these milestones. Um, and then from that, we put other things in place to, again, help progress the company to the point where this year we've just finished a financial uh, financial year and turned over just over six million. Uh, it's a sort of doubled within the, the three years uh, and now we've got plans to sort of within the next two or three years get to sort of 12, 13 million. So big aspirational goals but having that foundation to help enable that to happen has been huge for us. Big variance in, in businesses which is great because you get different perspectives on all different angles from people to your product to everything marketing um, so that that's that's a real bonus you're not just sat in a room full of what we are a manufacturer you know we had a dentist practice uh, we had a worktop place um, a marketing company so you do you get full aspects and full views and opinions on all different topics which is great because it just opens you opens your eyes a little bit Great question, um, and I think it's majority always going to be people. Um, we we've got a fantastic culture here. Uh, we've got really loyal staff, which is absolutely fantastic. But clearly, keeping those staff is is vital to us. 
uh, with spe especially how bespoke natured our company is. So the thing that we're working on now is succession planning throughout the business, which is, as those that have done it, is, is a massive task. Uh, looking at all the areas, here we've got what people want to go into, how quickly they want to do it, and if we can support that growth through extra courses or, or anything like that, that's, that's massive for us. Um, like I say, it goes back to being a family company, we want our employees to feel valued and part of the family. We, we don't we want them to progress, we want them to get better at what they do and have a better life for themselves, not just us. Do it. Again, if you go into it open-minded and you're willing to, or you understand that you may not take everything from a session, um, I don't think you can fail at taking something, whether that's from your cohort itself or from the tutors, your mentor. Um, you, it will add value to your business um, if that's what you want to do and how you want to approach it.